right guys, so thank you very much for tuning into this video. So I just wanted to add a little bit of context. This whole day was provided for and sponsored by private company Coffee. Make sure you go check them out, they're in the description below. And as well, the grounds that we were playing at was Op Tactical The Kingdom. So go check them out, link is in the description below. Thank you very much and enjoy. What is going on? Welcome back. I'm sorry I've been away for a while. Um, so today, uh, we've got members of the Special Forces, uh, SES, who are teaching airsoft players and veterans like myself. We've got a couple of guys that are ex-infantry, ex-army, stuff like that, joining in today as well. And we're going to go through some skills and drills, um, yeah, and see where it takes us. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you real soon. Right, so we're patrolling out. Weapons forward. Contact front. Move. Back to six. In line, and then baseline, baseline. Then everyone shouts baseline. We're then firing. We're building up the rate of fire. We're winning that firefight. What we'll do now is we'll swap us three with you three, and you can go from there. Contact front! Yeah, okay. Baseline! Peel left! Good effort, good effort, let's go. Go! Leave so you're the last man left out in the open, you can face the direction of the ground. That's one! So we'll, we'll, talk to, uh, we'll talk for it once dry, and then he's going to do the actual entry uh, with a weapon, yeah? So all it is, weapon trailed on the door again. Just close it in, nice and slow, making sure I'm not tripping over myself. All the way up to the doorway. Number two is then going to box round. As he's boxing round, he's keeping his weapon pointed inside the room. If he was to get engaged, he'd fire and then keep moving. I give three rocks to my weapon. On the third rock, he's blowing the door. All I'm then going to do, box round. I'm in and taking a dead space. The dead space is quite rightly called the dead space because if you don't check it then you're dead so I'm clearing the majority of the room 90% within seconds he's then gonna go around box in take the corner if, yeah if you don't get it the idea is there's someone behind the corner I walk in he goes to shoot me as my his weapons trailed on me the next bloke gets him hopefully before it always happen like that but that's why you've always got to be nice and close on your on your man Real time, you'd be using flashbangs and grenades before you're going in every room. So whatever's in there is not going to probably be able to pull a trigger. Good. Go. 
So we use the uh, you use your shotgun, like you said, on, on the locks or the hinges. What we do then, as soon as the first two are in, we then flood the room, okay? Because the idea is, I get it, there's another three blokes in there ready to take the fight. You've not then lost that room and have to retake it. If there's someone behind the sofa, a, a fridge, hard cover, you go in, you get waxed, your mate gets waxed, the other two get scared, bug out. You've then got to retake that room and you lose another two blokes. So don't ever come back, always go forward for a room. Um, they account for 80% of casualties on the break-in. They account for it, it doesn't happen. But um, if an enemy wants to defend the building, they, they will defend it properly. They're going to try and get away when they don't feel they're going to win it. And then all you do is lean out the window or bomb or the cord and get some. Door shot, the door shot. <laughs> good effort, good effort. Get in the back. As soon as they're clear, you're going to open up. As soon as they get clear, fire. And right until they get in the back. Let me know what everyone said. No, you know, it's not roof or not. Yeah. Everyone in? Go, go, go. No, no. Go. Yeah, not really do. Time you on till? Ah, four o'clock today, <laughs> man. <laughs> yep, yeah, all good. Cool, same crack, we're gonna go on patrol. In a ambush rich Go to the second vehicle, go.